Steam has been a popular mode of conveying energy since the Industrial Revolution. Steam is used for generating power and also used in several process industries. In most industrial applications, the boiler is essentially a closed vessel inside which water is stored. Fuel, which is generally coal, is burnt in a furnace and hot gases are produced. These hot gases come in contact with water vessel, where the heat of these hot gases transfer to the water. Hence, steam is produced in the boiler. Then, this steam is piped and taken into areas of specific heating application. The boiler efficiency to a large extent depends on the combustion chamber efficiency. Improper combustion leads to unburnt fuel in the chamber. Also, high amount of excess air leads to significant dry flue gas losses from the boiler. The solution to significant energy loss in the steam generation process is the installation of automation and control system in the boiler. The system consists of a PLC-based control panel, steam flow meter, pressure gauge, TDS monitoring and blowdown control system, online flue gas analyzer, temperature sensors and data logger applications. There are four major types of heat losses occurring in a conventional boiler. Stack loss, unburnt loss, on-off loss and blowdown loss. The improved system cuts down stack loss by trimming excess air in flue gas by IDFD control automation based on furnace pressure, stack oxygen and boiler load. It reduces unburnt loss by optimizing fuel feed rate and analyzing steam loading patterns, stack oxygen level and induced draft. It also controls the forced draft based on stack oxygen and furnace draft pressure values at different loads in a synchronized manner. The advanced system controls blowdown water automatically based on TDS level of the boiler water. It also analyzes the blowdown quantity and feed water temperature patterns. The technology changes the operating parameters to arrest on-off losses by analyzing the fluctuations in load patterns generated by the boiler system. The automation and control system provides many benefits. Process specific benefits include Correct air to fuel ratio is maintained. Maintaining stack oxygen at the optimum level of 4 to 7 percent. Higher combustion efficiency is achieved. Reduction in suit formation. Limiting the number of on-off cycles. Minimal thermal stress on the boiler. Drum TDS maintained at an optimum level of 3500 ppm. Minimizing direct blowdown heat loss due to draining of blowdown water. To understand the cost-benefit analysis, let us consider an 8 TPH furnace. The installation of the system will lead to an improvement in the boiler efficiency by 3 to 5 percent. Considering 8 tons per hour boiler, the installation of boiler automation leads to a saving of 50 to 60 tons of oil equivalent of energy. Monetary savings of rupees 8 to 10 lakhs and GHG emission reduction of 240 to 250 tons of carbon dioxide emission annually. The investment required for this technology is rupees 14 to 16 lakhs, which can be recovered within a period of two years' time. Different parts of the boiler house should be connected with the automation and control system properly and should be regularly monitored and calibrated. Failure of one sensor may lead to complete system malfunction. Also, the system requires additional skilled manpower for operation. The technology of automation and control system for boilers are readily available with many indigenous manufacturers as well as foreign ones. 
अंदर का टेम्परेचर फिर ऑक्सीजन का लेवल सब कुछ अपने आप उसके वहाँ सेंसर लगे हुए हैं कई बार क्या होता है ज़्यादा कोल डाल देता था तो कच्चा कोल जलता था चिमनी में भी आपका धुआं कच्चा कोल जलेगा तो धुआं निकलेगा तो एनवायरमेंट वाइज भी ये बहुत एफिशिएंट है इफ इम्प्लीमेंटेड बाय हंड्रेड यूनिट्स ऑप्टिम एयर फ्यूल रेशियो कैन बी अचीव द टेक्नोलॉजी कैन लीड टू अ सेविंग ऑफ फाइव थाउजेंड टू सिक्स थाउजेंड टन ऑफ ऑयल इक्विवेलेंट जी एच जी इमिशन रिडक्शन ट्वेंटी फोर थाउजेंड टू ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड टन ऑफ कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड इमिशन एनुअली